please believe these words. Before, I couldn't always be with you. But that's all changed now. You see, there's no time in heaven. Which means I can never be without you. So, I'm always with you. I'm with you now as you hear these words. I can see things much more clearly than before. I can see that the biggest part of us always remains in heaven and only a tiny consciousness comes to earth. So you see, the bigger part of you is here with me now. It's not so easy to see me as before, but that's okay. It's only because you're looking through that tiny earthbound consciousness. I was brought back because I was needed to be closer to God and to you. Heaven is even better than I thought it would be. You see, it isn't a place, it's a feeling. Imagine the most wonderful feeling ever. Multiply it by the biggest number ever. Well, that's where I live now. Heaven is far too wonderful to be a place. Things can happen to places. They're a bit like bodies. That's why we don't need them here. It's okay if you doubt what I'm saying. It's just that there's no doubt in heaven. If you're wondering why I talk as if you're not with me, it's only because I'm talking to that tiny earthbound part of you. When that part is ready to be released, you know then what I know now. Please don't hurry to be with me. You already are. We have eternity. I can see it. It's so wonderful. The rest of your life could seem long. But remember, it's only a tiny consciousness in eternity. Allow yourself to grieve. It's natural. Allow yourself to doubt. It's natural. Remember, I'm always with you. It's natural. The pain you feel, I understand. But no, your tears are not needed for me. How can they be? when I'm standing in heaven next to you. All our good times are not gone. I'm in them still and you're with me. Please believe me, no stranger wrote these words. Our love did. Now there are no goodbyes, no farewells. How can they be when you're here with me now? Just as I am with you. So I wait with you, until you, like me, are freed. Freed from that tiny, tiny consciousness called life. Until then, I ask just one thing of you. Please, believe these words.